in the truth set of 5 multiplying 3x minus 5 then minus 2 multiplying x minus 7 or equal to 11 we have to find the truth set of this equation now what we have to do is to first expand the bracket by multiplying the number outside the bracket by each term in the bracket multiplying the number outside the bracket by each term in the bracket so let's expand it 5 multiply 3x give us gives 15x 5 multiply negative 5 gives negative 25 5 sorry minus 2 multiplying x gives negative 2x negative 2 multiply negative 7 gives positive 14 or equal to 11 now that we've taken up the brackets the next thing to do is to group like terms so let's group like terms grouping of like terms so we can decide to send all the constant number to the right hand of the equal sign or the left hand of the equal sign anywhere you want to arrange it is okay so i am maintaining those having the coefficient of x okay so i have 15 x minus 2 x equal to i have my 11 here i'm sending my negative 25 to this side and that would be what positive 25 and I'm sending the positive 14 to, to the right hand side that will become negative 14 good so 15 X minus 2 X gives 13 X equal to 11 plus 25 gives 36 minus 14 gives 22 now we want x we don't want 13 x so what we do is to divide both sides by the coefficient of x here which is 13 so you divide this one by 13 you divide this side two by 13 so 13 divided by 13 gives you one one multiply x gives you gives x equal to we have 22 out of 13 now this is not the answer we were asked to find the truth set of the equation so after reaching this what you have to do is to write the truth set so in this case since we have the answer for the equation to be x equal to 22 divided by 13 we write the truth set as x except that x is equal to 22 divided by 13 so this becomes the final answer for the question 5 multiplying 3x minus 5 minus 2 multiplying x minus 7 and then equal to 11 our final answer is x is said that x is equal to 22 over 13